Just answering questions with WebTech on this channel. Here we go. Some random heckler said, You're barking up the wrong tree and we are watching you. Get the hint? Yes. New subscriber. And this was posted under a video where I compared my search engine ranking, because someone demanded I do it, to their search engine ranking, which keeps dropping. But I did notice today that I can check the previous attempts at doing this every once in a while I'll Google myself. And uh, I archive it. So anyway, that'll be listed below. But anyway, if anybody's curious, um, uh, my search engine ranking's been dropping, so let's cover the two subjects. The first subject is whatever I've been posting about on more than one channel, which was the Oklahoma City bombing. That's the most likely reason to come over onto my channel and ignore the subject matter you're mad at and post about Lee Wheelbarger. But anyway, let's go after not Lee. Google search results uh, versus every other search engine. By the way, I'd like to point out that IXQuick, Xquick, I've tested it, it's supposed to be anonymous and all that, it gives you the same exact Google-based results. So, at best, it's just anonymizing the same old responses. Google search for me uh, for video, or just for search, excuse me. First three things come up are videos, and they're defamation videos. There's like eight defamation videos with very few views on them. My channel has all the views. Google is deliberately making sure you get negative SEO on the page. Aggravating people and annoying people. Outrage gets page views. Google manipulates you emotionally. One defamation website used to be three or four. So maybe they deranked them? No. No YouTube videos of mine. None of my channels. One of my Vimeo channels came up. Not BitChute, not any place that actually has my information up. Only pages of people sometimes mirroring me. Google pick search for me. 70% of them are defamation results. Even though the websites that do the defamation have one-tenth of the number of pictures total. Literally biasing towards defamation again. Uh, vid search. Nobody ever uses the vid search from the main page. We just go to the video page like let's say YouTube or Vimeo or whatever, whatever it is, it's 10 per page. Some of them are mirrored videos, in fact, a large number of them in some cases. But on the page one, it only does one thing. It points to a fake WAPTEC channel, first thing, and um, one vid. It actually posts a vid. Okay, that's cool. Next, page two, no vids or chans of any kind unless they're defamation or mirrored. Not me. Uh, page three, three of my vids, one of my channels, the rest of them were defamation and or mix, depending on if you logged in or not, uh, sometimes mirrors. Page four finally has half of them being my vids but no channel data. Page five has two of my videos and no channel data or channel references of any kind. Talk radio blasting on a car stereo. Next, on page five, two videos, no channels, and then page six goes bizarre and off the rails by having uh, it's Google's usual behavior of unrelated re results. Now, I'm not trying to be uh, I'm not trying to be sour grapes about this. If someone is attempting to find my channel by looking it up through Google, that is the last place you'll find it. That wasn't the way it was a year ago. Even if I had a brand new channel, if I put up the three videos a day I put up, my channel would show up. Google is actively filtering out people they don't like. Uh, my channel name is the kiss of death. So the easiest way around this is to destroy my branding or pay them money Which is what happens or do what the defamation pages do and literally pay them money to jack up their search engine ranking They take bribes Now again, this sounds like sour grapes, but the fact is is that um, X number of well a year ago or more I had a YouTube channel that got 57,000 views on one video. That's the word that's the most extreme I've ever had I think and the immediate result was not to flag the video that obviously pissed off Google, but for Google to allow or cause the flagging of an unrelated video on purpose that has nothing in it, it was a shout out video, and kill off my channel on a one strike and you're out basis. I just wanted to point that out. And I've also dealt with them shutting down my channel entirely by doing one strike and you're out uh, for copyright infringement. It's supposed to be three strikes. They don't follow their own rules at all and they don't have to. And that's just A-OK. -okay. Hence the purge happening. 
but the thing that drove someone to show up at the location they were at and go berserk on them is real because even though my search engine ranking is actually you know uh, this is the the warble garble test when you go on google and google yourself which is something he does all the time um, your ranking should drop if they don't like you and it should drop compared to somebody more famous and more stable and mine does his drops more too apparently somehow he lost 14,000 results at one point just wanted to point out that this manipulation of the results is real if you don't believe me uh, set up a completely blank install of a web browser or open a private window where it doesn't carry any previous data or login data or cookies and look up any subject you want to only once and right click and open it in videos pictures news and see if it comes up correctly if it comes up the way it should I mean you can do this judging any subject it doesn't matter what it is and then compare it to Bing and Yahoo uh, and again Xquick doesn't do any better than Google I think they're just copying Google data which means I would not trust Xquick anymore it has another name you might want to look up